Back, property association fee hikes are putting many people in a bind trying to hold on to their investment property or home. The fee increases started around the pandemic and show no signs of ever retreating. Brian Burns joins us live in studio to tell us how it affects property owners in the coastal bend. Brian. Well, Leslie Rudy, you've heard about major increases in property taxes and other expenses involved in owning a home or condo, usually in the form of HOA fees. Some owners say it priced them right out of such ownership. Price increases started about two years ago with insurance. We saw a 30 or a 26% increase in our insurance, and it was, we were already paying $23,000 to $35,000 a year. And so that up 30 percent. Holly Howard owns a condo on Padre Island. She says the way inflation and price increases continue to climb, more bad news could be on the way. I'm anticipating a scary note, another 30 percent. As a condo owner and HOA board member, Holly says she's seen property owner association fee hikes force people to sell because they hadn't planned for such hikes. Property manager and realtor Gary Graham says it's a real problem for many. There are a few people, that, especially in an older community, if they come back and say we need to replace a roof or siding and, and they come up with a substantial uh, spatial assessment, the people cannot come up with that or they don't want to pay that spatial assessment and so unfortunately they do have to sell uh, so that they can get out of a bad situation for them personally. We check with the director of the city's housing authority to see if there are any programs that could help owners with unexpected fee increases. Is there a, a way that somebody can help with that insurance temporarily? Not that I know of right now, but certainly if somebody could come up with a great idea of how to make that work, I think it would be, be very beneficial for everybody. Graham says don't buy into a property on impulse. You know, I would just caution buyers that are buying into uh, multifamily with a homeowners association or a subdivision with a homeowners association that they do their homework up front first to make sure they fully understand what they're getting into. Now, according to Forbes nationwide, annual dues average $291 a month or about $3,500 a year. But some folks report their HOA fees are more than their monthly mortgage payments. So asking your realtor becomes critical for any property ownership. Rudy, Leslie. All right, thank you, Brian.